students, how are you today? This is Teacher Liz from Watcheller School and today we are going to learn about the different uses of computer. So we can do a lot of things on the computer and today we are going to learn about those today. Are you ready? Yes, you are! So let's start with the first one. Okay, so this look at the picture. What is it? It's a computer, very good. And as what we have learned last time, this is a computer and what are the different parts of the computer? Can you still remember? What is this? A monitor. Very good. This is a monitor. How about this one? What part of a computer is it? A keyboard. Again, please. A keyboard. And we have this one. This one is a CPU. A CPU. Great! And how about this one? A mouse. A mouse. So these are the basic parts of a computer. Now let's proceed to the different uses of a computer. Vocabulary practice. First one, look at the picture and please repeat after me. Play games. Again, please, play games. Look at the picture. The little girl is playing a game on the computer. Play games. Next, how about this one? What are they doing? They're eating popcorn and what are they doing on the computer? Everybody say, watch movies. Again, please, watch movies. So in the computer, you can play games and you can also watch a movie. Next, how about this one? Listen to music. Please repeat after me. Listen to music. So look at the picture. The girl is listening to music on the computer. Listen to music. Next. How about this one? Look at the picture. Everybody say, draw a picture. Again, please. Draw a picture. So, the little boy is drawing a picture in here using the computer. So, in the computer, you can also draw a picture. You can watch movies and play games and listen to music. And this one, you can draw a picture. How about this one? Look at the picture. So if you are connected to the internet, then you can surf the internet. You can go to Facebook or Google or YouTube to watch videos if you are connected to the internet. Okay, everybody say, surf the internet. Again, please surf the internet.
Next, how about this one? So if you are connected to the internet, you can use your computer to write emails. You can write emails and send them. Write emails and send emails. Let's proceed to the next one. This is the last one. Look at the picture. You see a girl chatting with her friend using the computer. So if you are connected to the internet, you can chat with a friend. Please repeat after me. Chat with a friend. Okay, so those are the different uses of the computer. Let's have a review. The first one is, you can play games. Next, you can watch movies. Next, you can listen to music. And you can draw a picture using the computer. And if you are connected to the internet, then you can surf the internet. You can also write and send emails. And lastly, you can chat with a friend. Now let's have a conversation practice. The question is, what can you do on the computer? Answer, I can blank. You can say, I can write emails. I can watch movies. I can listen to music. Okay, those are the possible answers. So let's start. I will ask the question and you will answer. Are you ready? Yes, you are. First one. What can you do on the computer? Look at the picture. The answer is, I can play games. Very good. Next, what can you do on the computer? Answer, I can watch movies. Great! How about the next one? Question, what can you do on the computer? The answer is, I can listen to music. Great! Let's proceed to the next one. What can you do on the computer? Answer, I can draw a picture. Very good! Next, Question, what can you do on the computer? Look at the picture. The answer is, I can surf the internet. Great! How about this one? What can you do on the computer? Look at the picture. The answer is, I can write emails. And this is the last one. What can you do on the computer? The answer is, I can chat with a friend. Very good. 
So, so that's all for our conversation practice. Now let's have a review. Our topic is about uses of computer. The question is, what can you do on the computer? Everybody, please repeat after me. I can listen to music. I can play games. I can draw a picture. I can watch movies. I can surf the internet. I can write emails. And lastly, I can chat with a friend. So that's all for our today's lesson, everyone. I hope you learned something from me today. Please don't forget to wear your mask if you go out and wash your hands often. So that's all for our today's lesson. See you again next time. Goodbye!